Now to look at the border effect tool, so we're going to drag this down, the first type is solid, so we're going to increase the size and see how that looks. As you see a white border has appeared and we can change this to any colour that we want. Um, now one cool thing is that we can actually um, reduce the alpha for it, so we'll take that all down to black and we'll reduce the alpha when it's black, there we go. And as you can see, uh, we're watching this on Chun Wireless TV. So you can do this for like channel indents and stuff like that. And I've done this with a preset of a picture and some words there. So uh, forget about that for now anyway. We don't need to worry about it. Next we've got beveled. Now this will create a weird sort of beveled look, um, which will basically be any color that you wanted. Um, you can, put, yeah, as you said, any color. We we'll just rotate a few of those around. Now you can actually rotate the angle of it, so uh, you can create these nice looking effects with it. But I'm not really sure what I'd use that for. I can also increase the size of the bevel as I'm showing you now. And uh, that will give a nice effect. You can also create a blurred effect as you see Chun Wireless is right back. Um, and you can increase or decrease the size of the effect. Now I'm just going to remove these bits because they're not really... Um, they're not really useful and uh, yeah you can have a strange sort of look there anyway I hope this video has been helpful there uh, it's not been very informative I know but then again you can't really do much with this tool anyway take care have a lovely day bye